My name is Kara Moore. I'm a fourth year undergraduate biomedical engineering major from Baltimore, Maryland. I knew I wanted to do something involving biology, but my mom really wanted me to do engineering, so this was kind of like the perfect compromise. But I've always had an interest in creating things, and um, I'm very solution-oriented, and I feel like engineering is the perfect pathway to solving problems. I really came here because of the track and field program. And then when I started looking into the engineering school, I saw that they had biomedical engineering, which is a major that not a lot of schools have, and I was really interested in joining that. Biomedical engineering, um, there's a lot of women in the major, which is great, um, but there's also a lot of opportunity to uh, network and to interact with other majors. For example, my capstone right now, I'm working on a team with some chemical engineering majors as well. It was kind of cool to bring together uh, those two different sides at the School of Engineering. I got to meet the director of the NSF last year, Dr. Ponchonathan, um, at a meeting. So that was really cool and I got to tell him about my experience as an undergraduate researcher. So that speaks again to the networking opportunities that DC presents. I'm a part of NSB, which is the Nas National Society for Black Engineers and I'm a part of the Society for Women in Engineering. And then another club that I'm a part of, it's not specifically engineering, it's Black Women in STEM. Um, I'm on the e-board for that one, and it's just about helping to diversify STEM fields. They kind of just help me find my community within the School of Engineering. Um, it's nice to be able to work with other people that look like me and kind of have the same issues as me within the School of Engineering. It's also helped to diversify my friend group because a lot of my friends are just athletes, but it's nice to have friends that are engineers as well. The summer after my freshman year, I joined the IMSD program. It's now called the MARC program, but it was the initiative for maximizing student development, and they placed me in uh, Dr. Heiss's pulmonary mechanobiology lab, where I've been doing research on lung biomaterials for the past three years. Through the research here, I've been able to travel to two conferences. Uh, I've went to California, for Abercrombie's last year, and then I went to Texas for BMES, which is the uh, Biomedical Engineering Society's um, annual conference. This year, I'm going to Phoenix, Arizona to, for an oral presentation at Abercrombie's, and then I'm going to Hawaii for Elsevier's uh, ninth international conference on the mechanics of biomaterials. Through the IMSD program, which is now the MARC program, which stands for Maximizing Access to Research Careers, I've been getting paid to do undergrad research, which is really rare but I haven't had the need to go out and get an internship or a job because I get paid to work here. I was surprised by how many programs there were for women and black people in STEM, uh, separately and together. I feel like that's part of the reason why I was able to work in this lab and why I've been able to stay at BCU because of my uh, engineering scholarships that are geared towards minoritized citizens. So that's definitely probably been one of my favorite things about coming to BCU.